Rose all said the same thing about the emotionally charged show, Return to Lockerbie, as social media users praised host Lorraine Kelly. The 63-year-old was one of the first reporters on the scene back in 1988, and for the first time since the attack, she has gone back to Lockerbie almost 35 years later. Viewers took to X, formerly Twitter, and praised the ITV daytime host as many people admitted they were in tears. One wrote, just finished watching at Ria Lorraine's hashtag return to Lockerbie. A touching sensitive return to the scene of a shocking horrific disaster. Beautifully produced, an important lesson on why it's important to revisit and to understand PTSD. A second person commented, this is a heartbreaking and incredibly powerful documentary. It does just show though that there is always light in the darkness and that humanity will always win. At Ria Lorraine is very much still shining and very much a national treasure. A third said, I am watching Return to Lockerbie and have no idea how these people have got through this. Tear emoji. Another echoed, hashtag return to Lockerbie with at Ria Lorraine tonight was a hard watch. It might have been 35 years ago, but it feels like yesterday. The mental health and PTSD impact then and now is extraordinary hashtag never forget. Watching at Ria Lorraine and sobbing. So many people still affected by the horrors that unfolded that night, another penned. A sixth shared, watching at Ria Lorraine and hashtag return to Lockerbie. So sad at the trauma still evident. In tears just watching it. A powerful story update. Bravo Lorraine. Hashtag return to Lockerbie is such a tough watch, a seventh added. Two hundred and seventy people died in Britain's largest terrorist attack. The bombing saw a plane explode mid-air over Lockerbie leading to debris and bodies being strewn across the small Scottish border town in December 1988. Lorraine was one of the first people at the scene, covering the story for TVAM and, ahead of the tragedy's anniversary, and headed back to find out how the residents coped with the aftermath.